Hey investors, are you ready to uncover the untold story of Meta Platforms, the tech giant that went from near disaster to a jaw-dropping 146% surge this year? Hold on to your seats because today we're diving deep into Meta's roller coaster journey and trust me, you won't want to miss a single second. We've got the inside scoop on why advertisers are flocking back to Meta, the magic behind their AI, and get this, a killer strategy that could supercharge your returns. So hit that like button, subscribe, and ring the bell because we're about to reveal how you can play the Meta game like a pro. Are you ready to turbocharge your investing journey? Webull's got your back. Click the link in the description, deposit $100, and boom, up to 12 free stocks are yours. But why stop there? With Moomoo, grab 16 more free stocks. Keep them, sell them, profit from them. It's free money waiting for you. Don't blink, don't wait. Grab your free stocks today. Let's make investing exciting. Meta's fair value, the numbers you can't ignore. All right, let's dig deeper into Meta's fair value, which is estimated at $311. Now, what does fair value mean? It's essentially the price that reflects all the available information about a stock, including its growth prospects and risks. Meta is trading around $296, which means it's trading slightly below its fair value. This could be a signal that the stock is a little undervalued, making it a potential buying opportunity for investors like you. Now, let's talk about the market cap, which stands at an eye-popping $755 billion. Market cap is the total value of all the company's shares of stock, and it gives you a good idea of the company's size. A high market cap often suggests that the market has high expectations for a company's future performance. In Meta's case, this massive market cap indicates that investors are betting big on its growth and long-term potential. Let's talk about the risk-to-reward ratio. Are we rolling the dice or hitting the jackpot? Investing in Meta is like playing a high-stakes game of poker. You've got to know when to hold them and when to fold them. The company has received a moderate uncertainty rating from financial analysts, which is basically Wall Street's way of saying, hey, this stock could be your golden ticket, but it might also be a roller coaster ride. Regulatory hurdles and fierce competition are lurking in the shadows, ready to rain on your parade. So while you might be tempted to go all in, remember that in the stock market, there's no such thing as a free lunch. Meta's revenue rocket, is it skyrocketing? Let's zoom in on Meta's revenue growth, which has been outpacing expectations. The company's platforms are attracting more users, and guess what? Advertisers are opening their wallets wider than ever. But here's the kicker. This growth isn't some well-kept secret. Investors are already aware, and the stock price reflects this. So the big question is, is the revenue rocket still skyrocketing, or has it reached its peak? Now, let's talk about the user base. Meta's platforms are like the hottest party in town. Everyone wants in. The number of users across all of Meta's apps is on the rise, which is fantastic news. But, and it's a big but, more users don't always translate to more profits. The company needs to keep these users engaged and monetize them effectively. So, is Meta's party still the place to be, or is the novelty wearing off? Now, I'm generally surprised to see Meta's user base expanding, especially considering earlier reports suggested that younger generations were moving away from the platform. However, the data clearly indicates that Meta must be implementing effective strategies to retain and attract users. Advertisers. Are they loyal fans or fair-weather friends? And what about the advertisers, the lifeblood of Meta's revenue? They're spending more, but let's not pop the champagne just yet. Advertisers are notorious for chasing trends. If another platform offers better ROI, they could jump ship faster than you can say algorithm change. So is Meta's relationship with advertisers a match made in heaven, or is it a ticking time bomb? This is where AI comes into play, and it's one of the things that Meta has done right. Let's dig deeper. The AI magic, how Meta is winning the game. Let's get into the nitty gritty of Meta's AI capabilities. The company is using artificial intelligence like a wizard uses spells to transform ordinary data into pure gold. From content recommendations to easier content search, AI is the secret sauce that keeps users glued to their screens. But here's the million dollar question. Is this AI wizardry a sustainable long-term strategy or just a flash in the pan? User engagement, the stickiness factor. AI isn't just about cool tech, it's about keeping users engaged. The longer users stay on the platform, the more opportunities Meta has to show them ads and, you guessed it, rake in the money. But user engagement is a double-edged sword. If the AI gets too pushy or makes poor recommendations, users could bolt. So is Meta's AI creating a sticky web that keeps users coming back, or is it a spider's web that could unravel at any moment? 
the future of AI, sky's the limit or glass ceiling. And let's not forget about the future. AI is a rapidly evolving field and Meta is investing heavily to stay ahead of the curve. But as we all know, with great power comes great responsibility. Remember, with great power comes great responsibility. Regulatory scrutiny and ethical considerations could put a damper on Meta's AI ambitions. So is the sky the limit for Meta's AI or is there a glass ceiling that could halt its ascent? Let's talk about the ad revenue puzzle. Why advertisers love Meta, the cash cow, ad revenue skyrocket ascent. Let's get down to brass tacks. Advertising is made as bread and butter. The company saw a 12% growth in ad revenue last year, reaching a staggering $31.5 billion. But why are advertisers flocking to Meta like bees to honey? It's simple. Meta's platform offers unparalleled targeting capabilities. Advertisers can pinpoint their ideal audience with laser-like precision, making every ad dollar count. But here's the catch. With great power comes great scrutiny. Regulatory changes like data privacy laws could throw a wrench in the works. The love affair. Advertisers' endless romance with Meta. Advertisers aren't just spending more, they're sticking around. Meta's platforms have become the go-to destination for brands looking to make a splash. The diverse user base and multiple platforms under Meta's umbrella offer advertisers a smorgasbord of options to reach potential customers. But let's not forget, love can be fickle. If another platform starts offering better returns on investment, advertisers could pack their bags and leave. So is this a love affair built to last or is it just a summer fling? Let's talk about the bulls and the bears and who's winning. Team Bull, the optimist paradise. Let's kick things off with Team Bull, the optimist, because they see Meta as the next big thing. According to the Bulls, Meta's massive audience and treasure trove of user data make it a prime spot for advertisers. They argue that the company's diverse platforms, from social networking to virtual reality, offer multiple avenues for growth. But here's the twist. Being popular doesn't necessarily mean you're invincible. Meta has to continually innovate to stay ahead of the curve or else it risks becoming yesterday's news. Team Bear, the skeptic's corner. On the flip side, we have Team Bear, the skeptics who think Meta is skating on thin ice. Plus, let's not forget the elephant in the room, Google and Snapchat. These competitors are nipping at Meta's heels, offering alternative platforms that could lure advertisers away. So is Meta a titan standing tall or is it a Goliath waiting for a David to take it down? The wide moat, Meta's unbeatable advantage. Why Meta's moat is impenetrable? Let's talk about Meta's economic moat, a fancy term that basically means the company has a competitive edge that's as solid as a fortress. This moat is built on two pillars, a massive user base and unparalleled data collection. Imagine it like this, Meta is the king of a castle and its moat is filled with valuable data and engaged users. Attackers, read the competitors, would have to swim through this moat to even get close. But here's the kicker, moats can dry up, regulatory changes and user privacy concerns could weaken Meta's defenses. The long game, is it a 20 year advantage? Now, this isn't just a short term advantage. Analysts believe that Meta's moat could generate excess returns on capital for the next two decades. That's right. 20 years. It's like having a golden goose that keeps laying eggs. But remember, even golden geese need to be fed and taken care of. Meta needs to continually innovate and adapt to maintain this wide moat, especially with the ever-changing tech landscape and increasing competition. The final verdict, buy, hold, or sell. The investor's dilemma, to buy or not to buy. All right, folks, it's crunch time. After dissecting all the ins and outs of Meta, the burning question remains, should you buy, hold, or sell this stock? On one hand, the company is fairly valued and has a wide economic moat, which is like having a VIP pass to the stock market party. On the other hand, there are risks, regulatory hurdles, competition, and the ever-changing tech landscape. So if you're thinking of buying, make sure you're in it for the long haul and not just looking for a quick buck. Balancing the risks versus rewards. But wait. There's more. Investing is all about balancing risks and rewards. Meta has promising growth prospects, but let's not forget, it's not a risk-free ticket to millionaire status. You've got to weigh the potential returns against the uncertainties. Are you comfortable with the medium level of risk or are you the type who likes to play it safe? Remember, in the stock market, fortune favors the bold, but it also respects the cautious. Meta's numbers game, a sustainable comeback or a flash in the pan? Just when it seemed like Meta was losing its way with its metaverse ambitions, the company has made a remarkable comeback, pivoting back to its core Facebook model. The proof is in the numbers. Meta is up a staggering 146% year to date with a revenue growth forecast of 13.9% and a robust net profit margin of 19.9%. 
These metrics signal two major wins. Number one, an expanding user base that's more engaged than ever. And number two, a rekindled romance with advertisers that's driving ad revenue through the roof. While these numbers are eye-popping, it's crucial to keep our feet on the ground. A 146% surge in stock price within a year is like a rocket launch. But even rockets have to obey the laws of gravity. Those returns are not sustainable. That said, Meta seems poised to offer solid returns that could outperform the S&P 500, especially with AI technologies that could further optimize their platform and add revenues. In summary, Meta has shown it can bounce back and adapt, making it a solid company that could be a great stock to own own if you have reasonable expectations. So are you ready to ride the Meta wave or are you waiting for more signs? The ball is in your court. Now let's take things to the next level. Let's talk about the Meta playbook, unlocking profits with the wheel strategy. If you're bullish on Meta and looking to maximize your returns, one strategy that could be a game changer is the wheel strategy. So what's the wheel strategy? In a nutshell, it involves selling cash secured puts to collect premiums and potentially acquire shares at a lower cost. If assigned the shares, then you sell covered calls to generate additional income. Essentially, you're running the wheel. Now, let's talk numbers. Meta has a beta ratio of 2.1 compared to the S&P 500, which means it's more volatile. While volatility might scare off some investors, it's actually a goldmine for option traders. Why? because higher volatility often translates to higher option premiums. By selling cash secured puts on Meta, you can capitalize on this volatility to rake in those juicy premiums. Running the wheel on Meta could be your ticket to maximizing returns while riding the stock's upward momentum. It's like having your cake and eating it too. But remember, this strategy is not without risk, so make sure you're comfortable with the stock's volatility and have a solid exit plan. You've made it to the end, which means you're serious about your financial future. So let's keep the momentum going. Hit that like button and subscribe. Why? Because staying updated means staying ahead in the market. Want more? My Patreon offers real-time trade alerts to keep you in the loop. And if you're into data-driven decisions, my trading view indicators are available for a free test drive. No strings attached. So if you're about making informed investment choices, this is the community for you. Like, subscribe, and let's navigate the financial markets together. Peace.